Okay, so in today's video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create this evil fiery eye effect that you see in front of you now. It's very simple to create and takes no time whatsoever. All you will need is a picture of an eye, and on top of that, on a different layer, I have an image of some sort of fire, okay? Um, I can hide the fire image at the moment, and I'm going to select my background image, which is the eye image, seeing as that's what I'm going to be concentrating on now. I'm going to click on the pen tool and basically what I want to do, I want to make a selection all around this eye. To save time, I have already made a selection. I'm just going to press load selection. Press OK. Once you've made your selection, you should have something in front of you like this. The fiery ants going all around the eye. I then will unhide the fire image and I'll be selected on that layer. And I'm just going to press command C if you're on a Mac or con Control C if you're on a PC, and then Command V or Control C to paste. Now I can delete that fiery image layer, and now I'm left with this sort of fiery eye. Um, what I'm gonna wanna do is basically duplicate this three times, two times, sorry, so you're gonna have three of them, okay? On the first one, I'm gonna press the blending type to be soft light. Okay, you won't be able to see the change because you have other images on top of it. On the second one, I am going to go on blending style overlay. And on the top one, I'm going to go on blending style soft light again. Okay, now you will see the difference. For layer three copy, um, which is my middle eye layer, which is the one that was overlay, I'm going to drop the opacity down to around 60. I'm also going to go on filter, blur, and motion blur for this. I'm going to go on angle zero and around distance 999. All this will do is basically create um, the white section of your eye to be more yellow. I'm going to press OK. As you can see, it's already getting into place. On the first layer of the eye, the eye um, selection of the fire, I'm going to go to filter, blur, and Gaussian blur. I'm going to go on a blur around 9.9, .9, around 10 basically, um, but this will be different for everyone else. I'm going to press OK. And on the top one, I am also going to do a filter blur, Gaussian blur, but much less this time, of around 1.6. I'm going to press OK. Now what I'm going to want to do, I'm going to start lowering the opacities of all of them, just to see how the effect will change. Once I'm happy with the fiery eye, I'm going to go on my background image, which should be your original eye image, and I'm going to duplicate this. Once I've duplicated, I'm going to press Command U or Control U to pop up the hue and saturation dialog box, and I'm going to drag the saturation to minus 100. Once I'm done with that, I'll press OK, and I'll change the blending mode of this to overlay. And that is the effect right there. As you can see, it's very easy to achieve, not difficult at all, and takes no time whatsoever. Thank you for watching this quick Photoshop tutorial. Hope you've enjoyed. Could you please like the video to support the channel? Um, share this um, video anywhere on Twitter, any sort of design blogs. Join the Facebook fan page, follow on Twitter, and subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you, and until next time, peace.